Kia ora, I'm Kingi, Huri Aho no Waikato. I'm 11 years old, but I'm already pretty good at cooking hangi. My koro says, if you get the groundwork right, then the right results will follow. You know, like do the mai get the kina? Koro says, you need to make sure you use the right stones and heat them long enough so your hangi is properly cooked. Not raw like Uncle Hoepa's hangi last Christmas. It's a lot like investing. Our iwi has been doing the groundwork to make sure our tribal assets are properly invested. So we keep growing Putia to fund benefits for our people. And from that mai by Tiara Tauda has come Puna Whaka to Putangata. That's the name of our new Waikato Tainui Investment Framework. Puna Whaka to Putangata guides what we will and won't invest our Putia in. It also guides other kopapa like tikanga and responsible investing. It's about making sure our puta is invested the way our people want. It's the same as when none of the size of what will and won't go into the hangi. Pork, chicken, riwai, kumara, pumpkin, stuffing are in. Tofu, eggplant, avocado, kale, definitely out. But what's on the menu won't matter if the hangi isn't done right. Just like I know how to cook a mean ass hangi, Tainui Group Holdings knows about how to invest. Our iwi has appointed Tainui Group Holdings to make sure our assets are invested in line with Puna Whaka to Butangata. What assets? Well, that's our four funds that have now all been pulled so they're growing wealth together at the same time. Just like when the kai is all cooked together in the hangi basket. And boy is it a big basket. It's one billion, one billion, and it's this much putel. TGH looks after our assets like me and Koro keep an eagle eye on the hangi for any escaping steam. And we definitely have to know the right time to lift the hangi when it's cooked. And not listen to Uncle Hoepa when he says it's ready. Got any partai? Just contact Auntie from Tainu Group Holdings at pwt at tgh.co.nz.